welcome back. Getting healthy and fit in the new year now involves a lot of new technology too. And one local gym is taking personal training into the digital age. Joining us right now is Patty Light, the owner of the new Coco Fit Club and Chance here. Ladies, thank you so much for being here this morning. Uh, Patty, we'll start with you. It's such an exciting day. The grand opening for Coco. Tell us a little bit about it. Very excited. We opened in December and we figured best grand open tonight and we're inviting everybody between three and seven. We're thrilled and we're at Abacoa Plaza with my son Jared and Co talk, talking about Coco. We're a digital gym. We're individualized coaching and we're happy to be here. Now, why did you choose Northern Palm Beach County in Abacoa to set up your gym? I joined Coco Fit in Sarasota, loved it, became stronger, fit, more fit than I'd ever been in my whole life and knew it was time to bring it to my neighborhood, to, to where I live. Because you're from South Florida, you're happy to be back here. Absolutely, have been here in the past. And you're bringing this a digital gym. Now, Chance, maybe you can help us uh, understand it a little bit better. When you say a digital gym, what does that mean? What does that entail? And how is Coco different from other gyms? So we have a patented smart training system that we use. So there's a technological piece in there that brings all the customization together. So we do everything from cardio to strength to functional training, and everything's actually 100% customized to each one of our customers coming in. So we focus on that one-on-one -on -one attention, giving you a customized program that works best for you. Now the equipment that's involved, does it involve any high-tech equipment? Uh, does it involve smartphone use, an app, or anything like that? We don't have any smartphone or app usage. Everything you do is going to be in the gym. We do have a customized website where everything you do is tracked, and you can see all of your workouts and upcoming workouts. So you do have that digital aspect there. Very cool. And Patty, you said you started using Coco back in Sarasota. Nice. Um, what was it like for you to to go through this experience to get healthier? Why did you want to become healthier? Well, everybody at my age, I'm 61, and I want to be I want to be healthy forever. I want to live forever. And, and it, as you get older, you you always need to be healthy. But as you get older, you really realize that if you everybody needs to be healthy. And why? It's just it's, 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 it's such a simple question. We all need to age with grace and to be. Best, the best you look that we fantastic, can do. so clearly it's working. <laughs> and Chance, is there any um, suggestion for folks who are looking to get healthy in the new year, how to kickstart it and maintain it for the rest of the year? Because a lot of people have their resolutions. We start off at the gym and then we may not make it back by you know the summer. I'll tell you the biggest thing is accountability and that's where that one-on-one -on -one aspect really comes in handy is you have someone who's going to push you to constantly come in and not fall off after that new year hype ends and that's what we have here at Coco. Excellent. Well, we wish you a lot of luck. Enjoy your grand opening. <laughs> what time is it taking place? From 3 to 7. 3 to we 7. We have a ribbon cutting at 4 o'clock. From 3 to 7 p.m. Ribbon cutting at 4. Again, it's in the Abacoa Plaza. So if you want to get out there, support local business, it's going to be a great event. Thank you so much, ladies. We Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you.